Welcome to Campus Insiders Oregon. I'm Jill Savage alongside AJ Jacobson of Rivals.com and Duck Sports Authority. And AJ, let's get right to it. What's the latest in Oregon recruiting? Well, Jill, you know, this is football season and it's also recruiting season. And proof of that is last night there was a switch, a new commit to the University of Oregon. He was a Washington State Cougar, but now Braden Eggert is a duck, a six foot seven, 305 pound offensive lineman. Duck fans have been asking for size. Braden Eggert is exactly what they wanted. Now, the reason he committed to Washington State, well, at the time, no duck offer. After he got a duck offer, that next week he visited it for the UCLA game, and then last night, boom, became a duck. Let's look at the offensive line position. Are they going to be done with that, or do they still have spots left? They still have spots left, Jill. And the reason is they still have spots left. They have two guys, Terrell Crosby and, of course, Braden Eggert, that are now committed. That makes two. But it looks like there's going to be three or four spots at the offensive line for the Ducks this year. Talking to Coach Greatwood about that, he confirmed he's looking at three, maybe four guys, slots at least, that are going to be open for him. So expect another offensive line, or maybe even two in the Duck class of 2014 this year. Jill. We were talking about who was going to show up for the Oregon-Utah game. There were three guys for sure that we knew and then one guy in the 50-50 club who ended up showing up at the game. Well, Jill, we nailed it. Mostly. Now, everyone that we said was going to show up and that we confirmed would show up was there. The one guy, Adore Jackson, in our 50-50 club did not. But I'll tell you what, he sent Glenn Iannaccio from Sarah. He's a teammate, safety. He's a highly recruited guy, about a dozen BCS level offers. We didn't expect to see him in the stands, but he was there representing Sarah at the game. What were some of the reactions to the visits that the guys had? Yeah, I talked to two of the kids last night that were here. Buddha Baker was one of them. Now, I don't think you can go any higher than this, but I asked him on a scale of one to 10, how do you rate the visit, Buddha? He said his Eugene, Oregon visit was a 10. His mom attended with him, she loved it. I said, what was your mom's reaction? Buddha said she was speechless. So those are two pretty good reactions from the Bellevue star. The other guy I talked to was the Oregon commit quarterback, Morgan Mahalik. Morgan, he just raved about it. In fact, he is turning into the junior recruiter for the Ducks and Morgan talked to all the guys that were there, talked to all the parents that were there and made a great impression for other Duck recruits. That certainly helps when you have one guy who's already committed, who's helping you do the work there from a, from a different level than just the coaching staff. AJ, thanks so much for all your insights. We'll be back here breaking down the latest in Duck recruiting next week on Campus Insiders Oregon.